gobble, gobble, gobble. Alright, wagwan well, wiggity wah blow. Here we are, on the island. Artifact cave again. There's some GPS for you. Bosh. There's the map for you. Bosh. You can see where we are. Are you wondering why it's red? No, I'm not at a whorehouse. I just thought I'd make it look really scary. Seeing as you guys think I'm really shit at PvP, I thought if I do this, maybe people will be too scared to raid me. You dumb motherfuckers. My PvP IQ is way beyond yours, because I do shit other people don't do. So I'll show you why. And you think I can't build as well, which is, is, is incredible to me, but whatever. Um, so yeah, this is, I'm going to show you something now. 1000 IQ PvP. A PvP second to none. I am the number one PvPer in the whole of Europe. In the whole fucking universe. I am PvP. How about that? So we got, this is me entrance. So we got me turrets up, we got me gates like I usually do. If some motherfuckers were able to sponge and soak all of the turrets with dinos and cryos throwing in underneath, they're going to come over here and they're going to see this sign. Now, you motherfuckers are so dumb, you think that I'm so dumb that I'd leave a sign like that that says, do not destroy these pillars main base. Well, no, it's a trick. It's a fucking trick, because I told you, Faz and IQ, the only thing that those pillars are holding up is the ceiling above me. And the ceiling above me has a whole bunch of nasties that are going to rain on your head. So dumb motherfuckers be like, oh look, quick, let's destroy these pillars. It's going to destroy the whole base. No, it's a fucking trick. That's what I said, a thousand, thousand IQ PvP. But like I said, you, some of you motherfuckers are so stupid, you would think that I was so stupid to leave a sign there saying that. And then look at this, we're going to come here. I left the door open, born in a barn. This is a little backup area, I'll show you what we're rolling with here. Told ya, I'm on another level, you're not on my level. Obviously we've got my vaults, we've got your fridge, you've got your cryo, normal, backup, usual stuff. If you manage to uh, soak the turrets, if you manage to uh, destroy the roof and survive all that, I'll be up here with like, like a sniper rifle, popping the back of your skull. You ain't even gonna see it coming. The next thing you know, you're waking up in your bed in your base and you're thinking what the fuck happened, because I flanked ya. I told you, 1000 IQ, even that little entrance that I just did there is on another level. I think shit that other people don't think. You come along with your basic generic arc shit and you think you're fucking good. Well you're not. Anyway, back to the fucking base location. And for those of you worrying that I'm going to have an art attack, this is nothing. You have not seen me rage. Like, when I do my raid videos, I'm actually quite fucking chill to be honest. Like, it's just a normal day for me. Um, so don't worry, I doubt I'll have a heart attack anytime soon. But if I do have an heart attack, please write rest in peace in the comment section and back me up with any of the stupid people that write stupid comments. Because I know you are. You, you, you back me up. You, you tell them as well the same thing I tell them because they're fucking stupid. So shout out to you guys that are not morons, basically. Anyway, this base location. This is the third artifact base location that I have found that I've managed to get out of the artifact cave and you're able to build on top of the artifact cave tunnels. This is the third fucking time. Some of you have turned around and said that other people that do hidden base locations have got nothing on me. Thank you for that. I appreciate that shit. Uh, I'm glad people notice it. We're not coming, yeah, come and follow me. I've got a great base location and it's just a fucking hole in a wall that's a beach. That looks like my ex misses. Um, I've used that joke before, but I'm still going to keep using it. Look, it's my ex misses. Bosh, I like that shit on the fucking fly. Uh, anyway, you can't get lost in here. You're going to go all the way through the cave until you get to the end where you actually pick up the artifact. Now, I've kind of found a new uh, mesh method. Now, I don't usually mesh. Originally, for this base location, I worked out if you place the floor foundation at the right height and some ceilings, you could lay down, crawl into a hole, you get stuck because it's really tight, kind of when you stick... No, we're not going to continue that. Uh, so you get stuck. And then before, I used to mash the jump button and eventually it would push you through. Well, I'm not kidding you. I've probably gone through about two controllers. I've been mashing the fuck out of it and I couldn't get through. So I had to find a new way to get through this hole. And it took me two tries to find a new way to get the hole. So you need to make sure that you're standing up. You need to make sure you place the floor foundation at just the right height. You can pause it if you want, but it's right there. I'm standing on it now. And you're just going to place a bench down. If you place the bench, it's too far away, you can't access it, so that's no good. And obviously you still need to be standing up to sit on it, alright? So you're going to stand up, you're going to push yourself forward as far as you can, place the bench a couple of times till you get in the right place so it says sit. You're going to sit on it, and then you're going to get off of it and pull back, and then there you go, you're out of the map. Make sure that you've got a tech suit on, because there's a, a few fake textures that are not solid. There's one right there. 
There's a few more around the area, and I'll show you roughly where they are. The good thing is that there's actually a fake texture, and then underneath it you've got the real texture. Why Ark would do a fake texture on top of a real texture, I don't know. I haven't got a clue, it's just dark for you. There is loads of places to build on. I'll show you some of the areas where you'll fall through the texture. This this is fairly okay, Look, this is all solid. There's big areas that you can build on. We'll get to those after. Uh, this bit in front of me, you're going to see with what I was saying about the textures, where there's fake textures on top of real textures. You know, um, that's why I wouldn't advise building there. So, look, I just fell all the way through there. So that's, that's a bad one. Like I say, you've got to make sure you've got your tech suit so you don't fall fall down. Now, there's no death barriers underneath. Uh, there is water. What happens is if you fall all the way down, you'll hit the water and it will teleport you uh, back up to the surface. This is all this is all uh, solid. You can all walk on this. You can place foundations on it all. You can place cliff platforms coming off of it, off of all the rocks. That's not a problem. Go wild. Lots of space. There we go. Look, there's another fake texture on top of a real texture. Um, just a bunch of textures that have got no fucking purpose, just wasted it. You know what I mean? Here's a good idea. You know when they limited the turret uh, limit for official because they said it will help with lag? Here's, here's an idea. Here's an idea that will help with lag. Why don't you give us the option on our dinos to disable animation for your dino? So when we've parked all of our dinos and they're all parked up in our base, you've got an option to disable the animation. So the dumb fucking dino doesn't wag its tail left or right. Because if everybody on the server's got 200 dinos each, and it is 100 people on the server, that's a lot of fucking dinos sitting there waggling their tail. You know what I mean? Give us the option to disable dino animations. And I'm sure that that will help with a little bit of lag. But, you know, I'm not a professional or anything. So, maybe, you know, if, if Ark, if you're listening, wildcard, you know, I could do with a job. i tell you what you can do. You could send me... The, the new maps that you do before they release and I can find all of the glitches for you and all the hidden base locations how about that that's a good idea you pay me for it though I want two packets of Kellogg's and six pints of milk a month and then I'll be good to go right if you go too high in this area it loads the mountain above where the, where the blue orb is you've got the mountain above us right now it will, if you go too high it will load in the mountain um, not a problem, just go back down and it'll, it'll load back in the artifact cave again. And as you can see, I'm running everywhere, I'm running all over loads of shit. You can see where you can build. Um, too high, there you go, it loads up the, the mountain above us. When you're in this area, like I say, make sure you get a tech suit on. I don't want someone saying, ah, oh, I fell to me death. Well, why didn't you have a tech suit on? I've said it twice now. Take a tech, tech suit in here. Work out what floors are solid. I'm showing you which floors are solid. It's in the video, in, in front of you. Just watch the video. Pay attention, you'll be good. Uh, that big area in front of us, all solid. Solid as a rock, you might say. Ha ha! Ha ha! As a shit joke. Um, right, so I've got some ideas for some series. I might, I might, I might rage some more. Well, I, well, not rage. What I'm gonna do is every time I'm in a server and some idiot is writing some stupid shit in the comment section, uh, sorry, the chat, I'm gonna record it. And then I'm gonna take the piss out of them and make a video about it, because some people are fucking dumb. Like, I'll give you an example. I've got a fiber craft server. Everything on the server costs fiber to craft. Just one fiber. You want a rip? One fiber. You want a tech turret? One fiber. Everything? One fiber. Instatame as well. Motherfuckers, it's in, it says it in the server. Fiber craft, yeah? It says it in the message of the day. Fiber craft. Everything's stacked as well. Every single item is stacked. Near enough at a thousand. So you save a lot of infantry space. Anyway. Fibercraft, everything crafted with fiber and instatame. Yeah? Motherfuckers are coming on the server saying, Can I get a starter, please? Starter? Anybody got a starter? Starter! 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 Do you like my impression? Someone said I said it was like Lee Evans, so I'm going to try and not do the Lee Evans one. It's just a natural thing, I can't help it. Um, but who comes onto a Fibercraft server and asks for a fucking starter? Are you fucking serious? Like, do you know what? I ban people from servers for just writing stupid shit, like seriously, like rubbish, rubbish stuff. Like coming on a server, how do I get element? It's a fiber craft server, you can craft element in a rep for fiber. Like just stupid shit and like I'm sick of it. So you wonder why I rage? It's because I rage at stupid people on servers asking stupid shit like can you turn it to daytime because it's too dark, it's a fucking survival game. 
I rage because people write stupid fucking comments. I'll just destroy the fence foundations. Well, how are you going to destroy the fence foundations if they're covered by a gate, you fucking moron? Easy destroy with a mech. Anything's easy destroy with a mech. You could probably destroy Ragnarok with a, with a mech. The whole map. I'm not talking about bases. I mean destroy Ragnarok. So there's only fucking water left. Anyway, look, there you go. If you, if you go too high, you teleport through the, through the ground. You have to run all the way back around there. And that's it. That's all you're getting out of me. Someone said it in the comments and I absolutely love it. It's going to be my slogan. Professionally unprofessional. That's all you're getting here. You're not getting professionalism. Yeah, ain't it funny? The RGs, they've got an attitude problem. They walk around with their wings out. They say, what, you fucking want some? You fucking want some? What'd you say? I fucking do you, you cunt. I'll open you up like a packet of beans. Oh, look, he's pumping his chest out as well. Hey, mate, number one PvP here in the whole of the EU. You, b Yeah, that's right. You back off. Yeah, you motherfucker. Go fuck yourself.